it out. Možná budu muset vrátit a jít dokonce. What? You don't like Soviet society? I don't like it when people are happy because somebody up above ordered them to be. Hmm. Hmm. Isn't that how it should be? Happiness is for everyone, right? That is a very one-sided way of thinking. Happiness is a unique handcrafted product. Each happiness is a personal masterpiece. It cannot be mass produced in a facility, even if it is facility 3826. I'm kind of surprised to hear this from a concession stand attendant. More one-sided thinking? What if I have a PhD? Didn't think of that, did you? Atomic Heart become a human. Theater cafeteria. I'm only allowed to know things like quasi, relevé, attitude, and à la seconde. Okay. Ale Borka rozhodně něco ví. No, tohle je všechno teda cool and all. A pořád ale jsem ještě se nepodíval, co je tady. Je takhle. Je takhle, tady těch pater víc není. A... Dobrý večer, pane Silent Dream. Děkuji vám za váš jír jedna sabíček. Ale, ale, no tak to moment. Kdyby ta hra fungovala, akorát já teďka nevím. Čau, čau, pěkný večer. Nevím, proč mi to nevyhodilo ten alert, jako. Přestože alert box by mi to mělo vyhazovat. To neháže nic? Ah. Takže refund? Ne, teda jako... Je. A já to fakt nechápu. Jak je možné? Já to fakt nechápu. No nic, dám kopírovat tohle. Vložím to sem. A teďka nebudu nic řešit a mělo by to fungovat. A když přehrál ten tvůj alert znova. Tak. To už je správný alert. A proč tam lítají ty hvězdičky, fakt netuším. Nemám po kdo to tam nastavil. Nějaký idiot určitě. Každopádně ještě jednou moc díky. Moc díky. Silente. Vážím si tvoji potvory. A když už jsi v tom, tak teda mi můžeš rovnou hodit <laughs> subscribe na YouTube a follow na Instagramu. Pokud chceš samozřejmě. A říct mi, kde je tady ten elektrikář skurvený, protože já jsem ho fakt ještě nenašel. Tady prostě je to zablokované a neudělám nic. To obcházet tady jak největší trouba. Abre upgrade, když už jsme tady. Hele, je to, je to úplně super. 
Ze začátku mi to vůbec nesedělo. Jako říkal jsem si prostě, a, jako nuda, víš co, nic moc. Ale docela mi to chytlo za koule. A drží mě to, no. Že jako fakt, fakt na tom teďka mám, já nevím, kolik na tom můžu mít. Dám se, kolik na tom mám, jestli mi ta hra pustí. A jestli to někde uvidím. A... Hmm. Hmm. Recenze nechci. Já to mám přes Game Pass totiž a tady jako... Tady úplně prostě nejde, nejde jako vidět kolik na to mám. Žádnou jednoduchou jako statistiku. Ale řekl bych, že třeba 10 hodin na to mám už 100%. Teďka už možná i trochu víc. Než 10 hodin. A fakt jako... Za těch 25 korun, co stojí Game Pass, to rozhodně stálo. Tady jsme, tady jsme skončili. Tady. Nic není, tak ty vole. To je nějaká místnost ještě. Tam jakoby prostě za tohle zdí. Ale z nějakého důvodu mi tam ta hra nechce pustit. Možná, že to je jako podní patro tady téhle místnosti. Okay, that's enough for now anyway. No, šest patnáct znamená jako co? Jedna, dva, tři, čtyři, pět, šest, sedm. To nevychází. Protože tam myslím, že nový PC, takže budeme streamovat společně nějaký multiáček. No, to bychom rozhodně mohli. Bychom rozhodně mohli. Nula, jedna, dva, tři, čtyři, pět, šest. Takže nula. Jakoby nula, takže nula. Jedna pět, takže by tohle. Jedna pět. Hej, já prostě nevím. Já to asi budu muset vyjúlit. Not a password at all. Já to fakt asi jdu vyjúlit, ty vole, já to nemám. Abych to, abych to ztratil při tomhle s tom. Atomic heart. Not a password at all. Uh... Ha. Jo, že elektrikář je v nějaké místnosti, kterou jsme ještě nenašli. Electrician know the door code? The code? How did it go? One moment. Top button on the right. Or was it left? The bottom. 
A ok, takže dva nahoře a jeden úplně dole. Ok, to by mohlo být v pohodě. Potřebujeme všechny tři svítit a máme dvě rozdvojky, no tak to je tak jednoduché. Start the show. Wait for performance to end, jo, ještě ani nezačala. Requisit energy element 1. Já nepovím, co se chce. Čemu slouží ty týkadla, co mu z ruky, myslíš tu rukavici? Jakoby, když držím F, tohle z tak on tím lutí věci. To je prostě nějaká super nanotechnologická rukavice, která má v sobě vlastní AI a on s ním komunikuje. Mám tam i senzor, což je vlastně tady tohle z toho. Takový mu jako parťák, prostě by se dalo říct. Ty vole! To berou do pají tuhle. Hej, ale dost už. Sračku vítací.
Gaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaa
Debug mode initiated. Please enter a command. This is your time to shine, Charles. You're a smart-ass machine, right? Well, we got some smart-ass commands for you to figure out. Eh? Borka prostě dabuje a já mi co říkat. A la seconde, arms free. Done already? Oh my, you're talented. This is a new to you, though, isn't it? Do you want to see the same scenes repeated all around us? Or would you rather choose clear skies, We're done here. carefree bird song, and all the comforts of home? Unless you want to hear the heavy... Tady bude něco s těma... S těma stínama. Měj se, měj se. Užívej večer, Silente. Ještě jednou moc díky, že se stavil. I za toho Sabíka. Charles, do me a favor and give the lady. No one can control the power like this. Levee on the toes. Croce in the fourth position. Big arms in an alley. These robots kill for no reason. Debug mode initiated. Please enter a command. Your music. Think again. Enough for now. Debug mode initiated. Your move, Charles. Um, I. Elevate in the fingers. Anything else worth checking out? Attitude. Sometimes you think you're gaining on your nemesis, and he'll be with you in the grasp soon enough, and then everything will be happiness, smiles. Debug mode initiated. Yeah, Charlie. Powerless. First arabesque. And a mushroom cloud. Try another one. And the uncomfortable attitude that you've been had. Try another one. Releve in the fifth position. If I say, arms upright and loose in an along with your eyes and see the truth, dog. That's enough of that. Jako stopro je to něco tady s tím stínem, ale co přesně? Fakt nevím. Hra mi totiž nedává jako... Aha. Aha, tak já už jsem to prostě vyřešil, ani nevím jak. OK. Yeah, Charles, why is that head case whining about how Collective is gonna kill us all? I can't stop thinking about it. Could Collective really be dangerous? Of course not. Collective cannot be dangerous. That's all there is to it. Only its owner can be dangerous. To je pravda. To je pravda. Zbraně také nejsou nebezpečné. Nebo respektive zbraně nezabíjí. Zabíjí ti lidé, kteří je používají. You mean his discretionary authority? Indeed, it exists. There is no getting around it. The Alpha Connector, the one that gives you total control over Collective. There's only one of them. You said that yourself, right? Indeed. What conclusion do you draw from that? As long as Dr. Sechenov has the Alpha Connector, we got nothing to worry about. Is that so? Of course. Dr. Sechenov is as honest as the day is long. He's a hero of the Soviet Union. A genius who made our country what it is today. You know the boss better than me, Charles. I sincerely hope you're right. What's that supposed to mean? It means that too much has happened over the last 24 hours. All these events force one to see things from a different perspective. Like what? Consider this. 
What will happen if the Alpha Connector winds up in the hands of a man who wants to enslave the entire world? Dr. Sechenov would never let that happen. Molotov's dead, and nobody else would take it from him. And even if someone did, they couldn't do shit before Monday. And after that, it'll be protected by the whole collective network. Perhaps. But Dr. Sechenov will also control every aspect of the network's security apparatus. Yeah, I guess so. So you've also come to realize that Dr. Sechenov will not destroy the Alpha Connector after collective launches. That's why you said that the Connector would be protected, isn't it? Well, maybe he needs discretionary authority for his brilliant research and stuff. Why would his research require that? Would people connected to Collective really refuse any practical request made by the man who catapulted them into the next phase of evolution? Would you, Comrade Major? Well, I... Hmm. Yeah, I mean, I... Petrov's close. Any suggestions? In regard to your question, Victor has made a number of significant alterations to the theater. Arresting him will not be easy even in light of his obvious psychological breakdown. Prepare carefully, and try to avoid the Vogel's attacks. As for your own condition, I have one thing to say. There, there. Hey, Vova. There, there? What the f what? There, there, Major. Everything is going to be all right. <laughs> is that what your programming tells you to say when somebody's upset? You dumbass gizmo. Your understanding of my software algorithms has vastly improved. That is laudable. Oh, there, there. Petrov's clothes. Co nechtěl? 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 I have run a diagnostic on your body. My access to certain internal components is blocked. Hypothetically, Petrov could be attempting to interact with these components in order to influence you. Like you, he is in a state of extreme psychological tension. What internal components? There are blank areas concealed from my diagnostic algorithms. They could be polymer cavities caused by repeated use of the glove's abilities. Or they could be bullet wounds in your head. Nebo to, že jsem prostě robot. Crispy critters. You think I've got a goddamn bullet lodged in my brain? I could perform a deeper analysis, but the diagnostics could cause pain, vomiting, loss of consciousness, and extended migraines. Stay out of my head, Charles. I'll get a checkup after we get back from the mission. Nebo ne? Nobody's gonna own Collective. Dr. Sechenov is gonna launch it and everybody's gonna be equal. Brilliant scientists like him are above power struggles and other petty... Please select the desired pre... Polygonu jedna, jo? To neřeším. Polygon 9 a 12. Jo. Takže prostě já neřeším, po čem střílím, prostě střílím. Increase energy bonus, nepotřebuju. Menší recoil beru. Zbytek věcí už nemám. Cartridge, OK. Increase damage, beru. Tady tohle... Nemáme už. OK. Tak jdem dál. To končí. Vážně to končí prostě... ...ve zdi. Bez dveří. Vývojáři ty vole, no tak. Tohle mohli trošku aspoň jako. To je za místnost. Ne, pro, proč jsem tam automaticky vešel? Proč jsem tam automaticky vešel? 
Hear that, fuckhead? Show's over. There you are. Always breathing down my neck. Where's the doctor? Larissa. She... she dumped me. Unbelievable. I don't know where she is. Maybe she's dead. But what about Molotov? He didn't believe such enough, did he? Molotov's dead. Then it all makes sense. What makes sense? Collective will activate. And that's the end of everything. What? What's wrong with people controlling robots with their minds? You're the one who created the goddamn system, you prick. I had no idea what Sechenov was planning to do with it. Unlike you, he wasn't planning to kill anybody. <laughs> oh, really? You believe that? Then why did all those peaceful robots start hacking everyone's Because sense? you reprogrammed them, that's why. <laughs> Are you serious? How stupid can you get? Do you have any idea how long it takes to write a functional algorithm for a single robot? And there are dozens of models here. So what? <laughs> I'll tell you what. Combat mode was programmed into them during the initial design phase. And sure, no one ever thought it'd be activated here in the Soviet Union, and that was totally on me. But I can assure you that Sechenov's plans are far, far worse than this. And he has to be stopped! Bullshit! I'm sick of this crap. You're gonna tell me right now how to switch the robots out of combat mode. <laughs> Sorry. That's not gonna happen. Hell no. <laughs> I've already put everything into motion. Stop! This was supposed to be I said a stop. special day for us. Huh. I was going to propose to her the day Collective was launched. It was going to happen right here in the theater. How fun. Watch out, your hands! Give this to Larissa. No tak, jeho hlavu si hlavě vezmu, ne? P3 to Chilome. Come in, Chilome. Final. Do you have Victor? Petrov killed himself in a creative way. I couldn't stop him. Damn. Is his head intact? Yes. I'm looking at it right now. Keep the head safe, P3. I'll send you a special container. Put it inside, and the rest will be done automatically. Ale co? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the greatest show on earth. Today is the debut of a new rising star. Please bear with us if the act seems a bit unpolished. The young girl is still rather shy, but we'll work out the kinks as we go. After all, there's nothing wrong with a little kink, is there? It is my to present to you the lovely Natasha! So do you ever? No jistě, že já jsem si neudělal tu výbušnou munici. Já jsem takový retard. OK. Počkej, na co to, že to má rezist? Já jsem to zase zapomněl, kámo. Na, na elektřinu má rezistenci, ale ne na tady tohle město. Ok, to bude asi zlouhavý boj.
No moc mu to nedělá. Co se... On vyskočil a to mi dalo damage. Umřiš, pekouna! Konečně. Konečně můžu jít ven odsud. No a kudy? Takhle, je, to je prostě nasvícené, ale mě to nenapadne. Je to je, tu byl ještě jeden. Na dobrůtka nějaká. Jej, okay, never mind, jdem dál. What is your current status, comrade major? Uh. I'm detecting a loss of focus and an intense surge of emotion. My status? I'm losing my fucking shit. That's my goddamn status. I failed my mission again. Victor's dead, and I've got his head in a damn jar. And Sechenov thinks that's all fine and fucking dandy. Get it? No, comrade major. I've done a lot of shit in my day, okay? But I've never lugged a human head around as a trophy. Did you see that gigantic robot in the theater? There was a combat. Robot in the theater, Charles. But you know what really grinds my gears? No, Comrade Major. The rings. The motherfucking rings that asshole Petrov gave me. And you know why it grinds my gears? No, Comrade Major. Me neither. Shit. Jaké prsteny? Já se jen nepamatuju. It's okay. I'm fine. I'm fine. We're headed to Pavlov. Got any ideas? Pavlov is a secret complex located in a remote part of facility 3826 called Sahalin. It would be quite difficult to get there on foot given the large number of enemies. I suggest taking a vehicle and comrade major. 
This would also be an excellent time to enhance your arsenal as much as possible. Searching for other testing grounds is highly recommended. Určitě. A nějaké další testing grounds tím mrdám. Pro chvíli zašiu s tím, sorry. Musím otevřít čokoládku. Mám Viktorovu hlavu a proč jsem ji nedal jakoby tomu, tomu robotovi? To mě zajímalo. Ten dám mi přijde úplně jak hovnu. A tohle vlastně taky. Když mám tohle. Pěkné. S tím střílá ta bábi Zaja. Zaja teda. Zaja je observator, si je zina. Kurva. Ukáž? OK. Máme si nějaký upgrade. A furt mám jenom ten jeden skill, ty vole. Ok, já zkusím ten jet si tam dát. Uvidíme. Na ty bose se to bude hodit. Ten štít. Mele attack z recharger energy meter, ok. Reflect lasers back to enemy. To nepotřebuji. To je tohle. Pressure increases maximum range. Ok. Můžeme zkusit. Increase effect duration, OK. Apply to target, effects nearby enemies, nepotřebuju. Já jsem to dal, i když jsem to nepotřeboval. Ještě se to dá vždycky vrátit, ty vole. To je, to je fakt super, že to jde vracet. To je jako... Tato hra je prostě hrozně příjemná ve spoustě věcí. Já jsem se prostě vystříkal na zeď. OK. Co otevřelo s takovým zvukem, tyhle, že jsem čekal nějakého bose tam zase. Ale to je taková sračka. Běž tam, co děláš? Hej, ale tak... Já se poseru z toho!
Dobrý, máme to. Tady nahoře. Kde je tam místnost s tím lootem? No jo, to už si vzpomínám. Kudy se tam jde? OK. A já bych chtěl jít zpátky. Major P3, I'm waiting for you in the Pavlov complex. Everything is ready for your arrival. I'll be there as fast as I can. I suggest using a car to move between the research complexes. There was a surge of sprout activity on the surface. The place is positively overrun with mutants. Right. Mutants. Got it. Is that all? Just one more question. No. Pilatova wasn't there. I understand. You didn't find any gold rings on Petrov's body, did you? Two rings with beta one and beta two engraved on the inside? No, he didn't have anything on him. P3 out. Ah, to sem tady. Tak proto to tady bylo. How goes it, Sunny? Still in one piece? Hey, Granny Zina. Long time no see. I've definitely had better days, but yeah, I guess I'm still in one piece. Did I hear right? You finally got that bastard Petrov. Well, nothing gets by you, huh? Yeah, I got him. Actually, he kind of got himself before I could get him. Don't you worry. If you got his head, that means this will all be over soon. Já jsem chtěl podívat tady na ten lore. Tereška, jim do té laptek. Tohle jsem ještě neviděl. OK, dobře. Now you're speaking my language, Granny Zina. Mind if I stop by for a cup of tea? Stop by any time, Sunny. By the way, uh, you didn't happen to find any engraved gold. A zase zlaté ringy, kámo. No. I didn't, Granny Zina. The drop didn't have anything on it. Oh, that's OK. You just watch yourself, Sunny. To, tak on to asi ne, tím, podle mě to nebylo, podle mě to byl zase někdo jiný. Akorát tam byla jako hlava, ale to musel být přelečený robot nebo něco. Kdy mi je dal, než umře? Jaký prsteny? O co? Tady jde. Počkej. Petrov, Gold, Rings. Atomic Heart. Jak forbidden? <laughs> ah. Hey. Even Dr. Sechinov and I never saw it coming. On what basis have you drawn this conclusion? I just thought about what Petrov told me. Would you kindly be more specific? Petrov said combat mode was programmed into the bots during construction. He couldn't possibly have reprogrammed them all himself. It's true, goddammit. And why is that? Because Petrov was a pussy. He was a programmer, not a fighter. But these robots know how to fight. He couldn't have programmed them because he doesn't know the first thing about combat. That Natasha was armed with fucking missiles. Where'd it get him, huh? It's a construction robot. Petrov couldn't have armed it with missile launchers. He's not an engineer. He couldn't have hacked into the robot plant and started changing shit around. He fooled the central hub and made it think innocent people were an invading army. That's it. 
So why would a construction bot have built-in missile launchers, huh? Why would a civilian drofa have a damn railgun? Or an owl a machine gun? The signs are everywhere. Just like you said. Different perspectives. Unfortunately, after analyzing... I am forced to draw the same conclusion. Especially since your suspicions are more justified than you know. What do you mean? Exactly that. Listen to this recording. What duty are you referring to, Comrade Sechenov? Do you even realize... Petrov, that sick shithead, that fucking truth lover. Screw him. So much blood spilt just because he made the sprouts mutate. I highly doubt that Petrov had such a result in mind. He is not a geneticist or a plant breeder, and could not have foreseen all the consequences of the malfunction. Then why the hell did he do it? So many people are dead, and the ones with sprouts for heads had to get killed twice. First by the robots, then by me. Morally speaking, Petrov's action cannot be justified. We are in complete agreement in that regard. Fuck Petrov, he's dead. I feel bad for all those people. I stayed in the service after the war to stop this kind of thing from happening again. Now, you have my sincerest condolences for all that has transpired, Comrade Major. Charles, why does everyone want those rings so bad? You mean the beta connectors? Because they work, but are also considered not to exist. So nobody can prove they're out there, not even collective after the launch. Especially not collective after the launch. For collective, anyone connected via the beta connectors will simply not exist. But they'll be able to see collective. Yes, all of it. A person with a beta connector will not be able to influence collective from the inside, since they won't exist for collective. But they will know about everything that happens inside it, just like any officially connected human or robot. But can't an officially connected human or robot disconnect from collective if they want to? They can just take their thought device off, right? I believe so, yes. You believe so? So you're not sure? Or is there something you're not telling me? I have no data, comrade major. But no one can stop a person from removing his or her thought device. It's worn on the head, not implanted in the skull. That's good, I guess. Je dobrý, ale tohle už je trošku moc zase hra. To se uklidníme, jo? Tak, všichni mrtví už? Můj baťoch je přetížený, ale jakoby co s tím mám dělat? Znamená to, že už jako toho víc nepobere, nebo jak vám chápat hru? Jako ano, už jenom ta zpráva sama o sobě je docela otravná. Já budu radši pěšky. Kdyby dal, jako bych se dostal tady s těma sráčima všude okolo. Na konci, na konci mostu si to najdu určitě nějaké dost, jako znovu. Další 
Let's say you walk past a robot. The robot identifies you as a human, but you are not wearing a thought device. The robot fails to receive mental commands from you in response to its queries. So it realizes I'm not in Collective and tells the others about it. Then what? They all start giving me shit about it? Essentially, yes. But I can just put my thought on, walk past the bot and do everything I'm supposed to do, then take the thought off, right? Essentially, yes. Then why is everyone so hot and bothered about the rings? I can't say for sure. Perhaps it's an issue of convenience. Thought devices need to be reconfigured every time they are put on. A ring can be taken off and put back on without inconvenience. There's got to be more to it than that. Charles, the U.S. is constantly introducing sanctions against our civilian robots. Why do they do that? Do they suspect something? The U.S. government clearly has certain suspicions, or at least concerns. Yeah, it's their job to be concerned about their country's security. But they don't have any hard evidence. That means they don't really have a leg to stand on, right? Indeed. That is precisely why Petrov caused the malfunction. Right. He wanted to show the world that our city bots have a combat mode. Fine. But the Americans don't know that. So what are the sanctions for? The American government is using the sanctions to find a middle ground between the needs of the capitalists and the growing discontent of the working class. You mean American working stiffs want to get our bots banned because they're taking their factory jobs, and the capitalists want to get more free robots so they can get rid of all the workers once and for all? Quite right. The American government is feeling pressure from both sides. So the sanctions remain moderate without banning robots entirely. They merely set quotas on importing them. So why does the Soviet Union give a shit? Who cares if the Americans sanction us? They're the ones stopping themselves from getting rid of the working class. Well, good. We're all about the workers. The more restrictions they place on the import and use of robots, the fewer of our robots will be located in key parts of the American government when collective launches. So the Soviet government wants there to be as many of our civilian robots in the U.S. as possible when they activate combat mode. That'll make it that much easier to take over the country. I gotta admit, it makes sense. Mm, to dává smysl. Ne, nejdeme na za babi. Charles, what is this place? I mean, what is this complex even for? The Pavlov complex is the origin of all of Facility 3826's biological innovations. Nah. Unique experiments are conducted here, involving everything from breeding new species of farm animals to developing new space exploration technology. Outer space? You mean they make moon rovers here, not Chelome? Space exploration is about more than just vehicles. A spaceship and rovers will of course be required, but what then? What about after humans reach the red planet? You mean they breed animals from Mars here? Among other things, yes. In addition to breeding new species of animals suitable for Martian conditions, Soviet science is looking for ways to bolster man's ability to exist on Mars. So what, they're going to give us gills so we can swim in gas oceans? Gas oceans are on Jupiter, Major. Mars features low temperatures and lethal hurricanes. But you're basically correct. The capabilities of your species have yet to be fully studied. So the latest medical breakthroughs, new life support systems, all came from here. Indeed, Comrade Major. So many geniuses worked here for the good of all mankind. Hey, mom, loot. Kdyby takováhle hra hrála pořád, ty vole, teda hudba. <laughs> 